That's the only warning you'll get. Hand it over. Now! The recent games are action RPG games, open world action RPG games, and where the player can actually um, uh, dive into a very immersive world and uh, try uh, to rescue the world, obviously, as in many other RPG games. But uh, Risen has the, has the twist that uh, there is a very intricate storyline, and in Risen 2, uh, you're going to uh, uh, um, progress from being an Inquisition character to a pirate captain. The pirate direction has always been part of the of the heritage of the developer, I have to say. In Risen 1, actually, uh, you one of the key characters, Patty, the barkeeper, actually she is the daughter of Steelbeard, a mighty pirate in the Southern Seas, and that is why Risen 2 is actually snapping very nicely into the world of, of Risen. Well, fighting like a pirate means, of course, fighting not fairly, which means that you have a lot of dirty tricks at your di disposal. You can attack people with a trained parrot, you can throw sand in their eyes or salt, you can throw daggers at them, you can draw your uh, uh, pistol, you have uh, firearms uh, with muskets, shotguns, uh, etc. You have even have powder kegs you can throw and then shoot it and then they explode. So. Um, I think there is a lot in the game to, to play a little bit unfairly on the enemies. The creatures in the game react different, differently on your skill set, so when you try, for example, to kick a crab, actually it rolls over and you, then you can uh, kill it easier. Um, I wouldn't uh, recommend to kick an alligator, for example, but it, because then he's trying to, to bite your foot off. So um, each and every creature in the game will have its own weak point and you have to find out the weak point and that's also a very nice sub-game, I have to say. In Risen 2 you're not only a pirate captain, but you're also having your own ship with your own crew. And uh, this crew is uh, comprised of, of characters which are picked up uh, during your adventures in the game. So depending on your decisions, the crew will be uh, uh, different. And since the people are always there, you will also uh, uh, create a much, much deeper emotional relationship to them. I think if you ever wanted to live a pirate's life, uh, reenact a pirate's life in a very authentic, immersive world, you should play Risen 2. In Risen 1, actually, the console development started very, very late in the process. Risen 1 was never planned as a multi-platform game, and just very late on in the process we decided to make an Xbox version. Um, Risen 2 is now completely different. For Risen 2, we have now a parallel development on all three major platforms right from the beginning, and uh, this obviously has, has a bigger result. Risen 2 is going to be available on uh, Xbox 360, PlayStation 3 and PC and we're currently aiming for first half of 2012 as a release date.